Hey guys, Sean here. Today's Pyro Project. My supplier wanted me to build him some of these uh, adjustable slice cake boards. Uh, he wanted his uh, two foot by four foot, which is pretty pretty large. Um, you could fit, you know, the big rainbow slice cakes on here. Combination of fives, sevens, nines, blah blah blah. Um, in fact, you could fit probably three. Well, yeah, you could fit. Let's see here. Let me grab my tape measure. You could easily fit three cases of five shots on here um, and then have sporadic firing, of course. Um, but yeah, let me take you through this real quick. Uh, I went and picked up some two-by-threes. I ripped them down to two inches um, because mathematically for the amount of material that I have, um, I don't like scrap. So I try to figure all that out and be able to uh, build it so build things that just last. I actually overbuilt. <laughs> but anyway, so yeah. So there's a 2 by 3 frame that's been ripped down to a 2 inches. Um, I'm using MDO plywood. This stuff's fantastic. Um, it's a signboard. It's uh, impregnated with resin. Um, so I'll have to get a hold of Mark and see if he, he wants me to put a coat of paint on these or some kind of sealer or something. Uh, it's totally up to him. Um, but yeah. So what we got, we got the frame, we got the track. I'll show you better on this side right here. I got this centered up so and everything is together. Everything is well supported. And I have a place to screw into. Now, as far as the, uh, well, I'll just call it a fence or the stop, uh, which is going to go on this side. Grab one of these pieces just so you can kind of see. So that'll get screwed in like that, something like that, and come up uh, about five to six inches above the uh, surface. Now, I was planning on going the full 48 inches, but in all reality, I don't need that. Um, I'll have to ask Mark if he wants it to go the full length or only 36 inches. So that'll leave me six inches on each side, and that should be uh, way more than enough. But uh, I don't know. Then again, two, maybe four feet would just be the cat's meow. So, so the front one will be stationary, and then the other one. I'll grab this piece again. Actually, let's grab a piece of scrap. So, T-bolt will be through here, and then it'll slide back and forth, and this will have a face on it too. With some supports. So uh, I built my buddy uh, Scotty Rockets a couple. Um, they seem to work pretty good. Of course, I built them a little bit different. I just built them out of scrap material that I had. Um, but from now on, I'm going to start building them like this just because they work and they're nice and clean. So um, if this is something you guys are interested in. Let me know. Um, I've had a lot of interest in various things that I do that's uh, pyro related, bushcraft related. Um, and so forth. Uh, my problem is expendable cash to uh, be able to build a supply of this stuff. So um, if you guys would like something like this, a uh, two foot by two foot or 12 by two, you know, 12 by 24, however, whatever, um, let me know. Um, I'm kind of seeing a, a, a little niche here um, for a little extra um, income per se. So all right, guys, take care. Let me know what you think. Put some comments down there and a thumbs up, and we'll talk to you later.